Hello. Alrighty. So today I'm going to do um, a little bit of a different type of strip card. So I'm just going to do a few strips down the center and a few strips on an extra piece of paper here. So I want to see how this is going to come out. So let's make this. Alrighty. And if you're wondering what I'm doing with my glue here is I have this refillable glue bottle. It was an emptied out bottle um, that I put the the Elmer's all glue all glue into it and I'm because I like the nib that's on this the tip the tip is perfect to do all this little detail stuff with so and I've got a wet baby wet down in the bottom so I can I don't have to keep throwing my putting the lid on or sticking the, the little pin back in there I can just put that out of my way and I can just do what needs to be done, and then I can worry about the cover later. So there's a little tip for you. I know I've shared that before a couple different times, but you never know. Sometimes we have someone new watching the channel and they haven't seen the rest of it. Okay, now I've got this word hello and I wanna make sure it'll fit. Yes, it will. Alrighty, perfect. So I'm gonna go ahead and stamp this on here. Actually, I'm wondering, hmm, that should be dark enough. Alrighty, let's go ahead and do this. Alrighty, there. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, perfect, yes. Okay, I like it when it comes out just perfect, yay! have another baby wipe and put this in my container there so I can use that to clean off. Alrighty. There, that can dry. Alright, so we're done with that. Now I want to I'm gonna leave this sit for a few minutes, and while I'm waiting on that, then I wanna go ahead and glue some of these down. So let's start with the, the green in the center. I'll turn it sideways, because I'm gonna actually fussy cut that hello out. But first things first, I wanna do this. Alrighty, so I have that on there. color. I think I'll leave a little bit of white between and then another blue green. This mint color is so pretty. Alrighty. And then pink. And green. silly cat was as soon as I came up here he he ran up and jumped up here <laughs> so I had to pick him up and throw him over on the bed and I said no 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 not right now I'm gonna do a video and then of course my phone started ringing and it was my daughter so all righty I think that should be that should be wide enough Okay, so, and how wide is this? You know what, maybe I should put another strip on there. Let's do another strip on this side or a pink one. I think we need the pink on that side instead, yeah. All right, let's do that. Yeah, that'll work. Okay. So while the background is drying, then I'm gonna go ahead and fussy cut this out. So I need my scissors. And let's go ahead and cut this right here. So we'll cut that nice 
nice long white strip off because I can use those all the time. They're easy to use. Okay, so Fussy Cut this. And I'm not gonna, I want the colors to show. So that's the idea. So first I'm gonna cut gently around. Because I don't wanna get too close. Because I pretty much just want a halo going around the words. All right, and then if we can just do this and do the little cloud halo around it. This needs to be more smooth, so let me fix that. All right, that looks much better. I like that. Okay, and we lost a little bit of the green, so I'm just gonna snip that off and round it off. Because I can. All right, there. So, and I saw this idea on Pinterest a while back, and I drew it on my pad. <laughs> Whoops, what side? Oh, I took it off. I put it up here. That's right. <laughs> so this is <laughs> this is the picture that I drew. So the hello is going to go on top of it. So the back is like that with the strips going down. All righty. So let's go ahead and that's going to be pretty. Okay, so I need to outline this with black. I need my marker. I love to do this. My faux layer. Alrighty, so let's do this. My faux black layer. Gotta love it. All right, there we go. We got a black layer on there. Woohoo! All right, this is gonna be so pretty. Okay, and let's see. Let's see. That needs to go on there like that. But I want this to be a little bit thinner. So let me trim this and a little bit shorter. I think I went about maybe three and a half inches long. So let's do that. All right, let's see what that looks like. Yeah, that's better. And maybe a wee bit more trimmed off the edge. Maybe about that long. That should do it. Okay. Yep. All right, that's nice. Okay, I like that. So let's go ahead and put the black trim around here too. There. Okay, so there's another faux layer on that one. Perfect. All right, and then this can go on here. And then the only thing is we need a little embellishment for on there. So, and that's it. I like this. Okay, so let me go ahead and put this on there. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and glue this straight down. Did I get it? No. Thought I got some on my finger. All right. Nice, and then this is going to be 3D'd up. So I need some 3D dots. All right, why is this in the middle? Because it was cut off with this little doodah on there. May as well stick that on there too. <laughs> the little doodah and the big doodah. I don't know why, but the other day I was I was with my friend and we went to Walmart to do our our shopping list, the list that we had of things we needed to get. And uh, as we were headed out of the parking lot, I don't know why this song is is old. It's it was I believe it came out in the 70s. Um, 
but uh, it was short people. And I could, and that's, and also I could remember was short people got dun, 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 and I couldn't remember. And so I was asking her if she remembered that song and, and she, and she didn't remember it. And so I went home and looked it up. Oh my goodness. You got to look it up. <laughs> short people. <laughs> It's rather rude, <laughs> but it's kind of funny, but it's rude. <laughs> Had me laughing. Alrighty, I gotta see which one of these I'm gonna put on here. I'm thinking this monkey would be hilarious. Nope, the monkey. That is so funny. All right, let's do the monkey. And these are fine. Oh, it's just sticky on the whole back, okay. So what's that going to look like? <laughs> That's cute. Aw, I like that. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. I might need just a little piece of paper down here. So I'm going to use this piece of paper that was trimmed off. Because this is up a little. This is up. That's probably too wide. Okay, so I need it to be as wide as this. have to trim it just a wee little bit. Alrighty. Another neat little trick. There. Okay. So then that way, that will be the same height as this panel. So then it won't be wiggling around. Ta-da! Alright. And turn it sideways that way. That's cute. Okay. Hello and hey. <laughs> A monkey saying hey. That's so cute. Alrighty. That came out really cute. So what do you think of that? So we've got double strip sections. So we've got the, the word, the strip section with the word, and the strip section for the background. So strip background and word fussy cut word. Let me bring that up and show that to you. What do you think of that? Isn't that interesting? I really like this layout. Now I think it definitely needs some bling. So let me see if I can pull my black gems out. Oh, as a matter of fact, I might have some in here. Let me see. Do I have black ones in here? Blue. I do. Yes. Okay, good. Good, good, good. We can use these ones then. I've had these laying around for a while. Alrighty, so let's see. I think we definitely need something up here in this corner. I think maybe the next size down. Over here. I'm gonna try to make a triangle. And then the smallest size, maybe right here. Yes. Aha! Check it out. One, two, three. I like it. There you go. What do you think? You like that idea for a card? I hope you give this a try. So another way that you can use your, your strips of paper that are one inch or less. Alrighty. So think about that when you're... And this is new for me, right? This part here is stamping the word right on there. Um, the one that I had seen was they actually cut it out and then put it on. And I thought, no, just stick it right on there. That's a better idea. Alrighty, so I hope you like this idea. If you do, give it a try. And please give me a thumbs up. And until we meet again, happy crafting. Bye-bye.